Well, I called him daddy as a child. Then when I got older and more self-conscious, I started calling him Pops. My brother called him Len. Some people called him Maestro, but pretty much everybody called him Lenny. When I was a little kid, my father was like this invincible superstar. I was five years old when West Side Story came out, which was the same year that he became the music director of the New York Philharmonic. And then later on, when I was in my teens and early 20s, things changed. And so he became a complicated and a flawed human with successes and failures. When people read this book, I hope they get a sense of how warm and convivial and fun it was to be in our family. That's why our house was always full of people, because everybody wanted to be in our house.